So now you know how to check if the data are normal. Yeah. We haven't checked yet if the variances are equal. So coming back on the cars data, yeah, the empty cars data, which are the two groups that I want to compare? Well, the gas usages of cars with three gears and the gas usages of cars with four gears. So two groups, that means that I have to use this function. Yeah, when you have two groups, it's this function and it needs vectors as an input. That's why I created the vectors. So when I run this, you will get confidence intervals, a whole thing. What is important here, the most important part is this, the p-value. And again, the p-value is higher than 0 0.05. So you can conclude here that yes, the two groups have the same spread. 